I entered in a photo I took of Daniel going through the silt in Lucerne. And it's just explosion yeah. around it. It literally looks like the ground's exploding. It's so sick, dude. Yeah, that, that little silt bed is like really gnarly. Yeah. So gnarly it killed Daniel, Danny's truck. Like the first week on the job, dude, I was in the middle of China. They had MMA fights going on every night. They had concerts. What? They had like EDM. Like real MMA? Like there? It's Eric D. Podcast. Crew. Oh. <laughs> so I entered a, a, a photo I took of um, Daniel Tyson. Uh, we got him a set for his his truck build. What kind of tires were those? Uh, they're Toyos. Oh, <laughs> they are Toyo uh, thirty nine. This is not a race uh, tires. Can I just say this is not a shameless plug because no. Toyo isn't giving yeah. us for this <laughs> no, right now. No, right now. I'm yeah. just saying. So I entered in a photo I took of Daniel going through the silt in Lucerne. A uh, pretty cool photo. It's, it's a, it was a slightly um, slower shutter speed. So there's a sense of dynamic uh, movement in the in the photograph. Um, okay. The tires are, aren't are in uh, full stop focus. Right. Um, and there's, you know, silt blasting everywhere and all this good stuff. And so I was like, you know, this is a good photo. Um, I doubt anybody's going to submit, submit a photo of a truck on Toyo's going through silt right Be, or a pre-runner a pre-runner such an epic yeah. shot dude by the way it's, and yeah it's it, it's, it's, a, it's I, pre I, was one dan, I was definitely proud of for pre, sure pre ryan dan another terror crew brother dude i love pre ryan dan he's like the quietest yeah, coolest yeah. craziest yeah. effing driver if anybody's down it's pre ryan dan pre ryan dan uh, is yeah. down so pre ryan dan's charging through the silt section that me and nelson got to film a couple years ago mm -hmm. um and it's just dirt explosion is the only word that yeah. comes to mind and and you captured that so damn good and it's a great highlight of their product too because you could see the tires perfect yes and it's just explosion yeah. around it. it literally looks like the ground's exploding it's so sick dude yeah that that little silt bed is like really gnarly yeah. so gnarly it killed daniel danny's truck so that's what i was gonna ask how <laughs> how um you know which i got some really cool pictures of danny going through it right before or during the past that he killed it the the cool thing about silt is um it'll give you the best pictures and shots of your life but it will also can potentially Destroy. take your motor's and life i will say wholeheartedly i did not tell danny to go we were done yeah we were done in that section, everybody was like, all right, I, we, everybody hit it once or twice. And then like, we're good. Danny went off on his own. <laughs> oh, come he was on. like, oh, I'm going to hit it one more time. Come on, Michelle. Let's yeah, go. I'm going to hit it one more time. And of course, no, Michelle was like out of the truck. And she uh, was like, oh. Uh, she was like, Danny, don't do it. She's like, you know, every time I say, every time I want a new kitchen, he breaks the truck. <laughs> <laughs> every time I want that trip to the Bahamas, yeah, Danny. Yeah. So well, he, like Danny, yeah, Bahamas. Danny went off on his own yeah. and then came back through and then, yeah, sucked. Something doesn't pounds, sound right. <laughs> 10 pounds of dirt into the engine. Oh man. Um, but anyway, but anyway so, so how'd it go? So I, I, there was 19 finalists and one winner. Okay. Um, and I was, I became a finalist. So sick. So basically what that was is they hung up, they printed all 20 photos, uh, 24 by 36. They hung them up on this wall and then, um, they held this car show slashed art show. Okay. Um, at, uh, North coast Plaza. Okay. Uh, South, coast. South coast, South yeah. coast Plaza, which is like super fancy yeah. mall, right? Yeah. yeah. Like Bloomingdale's and Tiffany mm -hmm, company mm -hmm. and, um, well, some of the other high end places that I've never been to in my life yeah yeah uh but they had a super cool uh uh adrian was saying adrian's a off-road tire off-road rep for toyo was saying that they this little garage they had it in was like an old jiffy lube or something okay but they had it super well lit there was a there was a, a white ferrari f40 in there that like was like perfectly lit for all these photographers to take photos i took a bunch of pictures of it nice man um there was a bunch of rad cars some a couple of a few off-road trucks and stuff it was super cool experience, super humbling experience to see, yeah. you know, that I, you know, little old Evan can submit a photo of a pre-runner. From Madeira, from, from, yeah, from, you know, from getting the farmer to yeah. chase you with this pitchfork <laughs> yeah, to, yeah, yeah, yeah. to a no, professional up, South yeah. Coast Plaza, Costa Mesa. Um, um, yeah. yeah. And they, all these tuner cult dudes there, yeah. you know, it was packed. There was a bunch of people there. Dude, I think we need to do a Terra takeover over there next time. Like me and Pre Rand Dan need to roll in with the trucks next year and be like, "What up? What up?" Yeah. That would be so sick. There was no. I gave Adrian shit because there wasn't one pre runner. I was like, "Where's there's yeah. not one?" Adrian, Adrian's our friend from Toyo. Yes. So yeah. Adrian is the off road. 
tire Dude. Toyo tire route. Oh, we're gonna go hard next year. We're gonna be like gangster. Yeah. No. No. Seriously. I'll 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 bug, yeah. I'll bug the crap out of him. Like, okay. No, we're just showing up. I'm like, just... Well, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. But yeah, so well, that's super cool, cool super that's humbling cool. experience. Um, it, 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 Dude. or it's printed in a book. It got hung up on the wall. Um, they're sending me a bunch of cool gear. That's rad. As a being for being a finalist, which is good because I need I need some new stuff to carry around in. Nice man. Um, my old Harbor Freight uh cases seen better days i got hired by baldwin motorsports to be their their media guy right and it was a great experience i i i, I love the job um unfortunately you know bj and i didn't see eye to eye on a lot of things i have no issues with bj if i saw him tomorrow i, I give him a hug i have since we've parted yeah ways. that's cool man um, that's good yeah he's a nice guy my job was to follow him around and and but document you, what he was doing but you, know, you got so. to go to some cool places but i got to go it's like the first week on the job dude i was in the middle of china the middle like mongolian desert yeah mongolia which i didn't even know there was dunes and you told me it's There's like like the biggest dunes on the planet it's insane like it's dude. like a hundred miles wide or something, something yeah like that. and you guys are doing trophy truck stuff out we're there. doing trophy truck stuff out there so um, they shipped his trophy truck there they shipped they air freighted his trophy truck there jesus christ um yeah it cost a lot of money they flew us first class wow yeah so we went to this place it was called oh i don't even know what it's called but it was like the city in the middle of the dunes yeah and like they built like a four-lane highway to it is that the gobi desert it's the gobi desert ah uh, yeah it's the gobi desert um and it was like a whole full city they had like they were like building a landing strip so you could fly into this off-road park surrounded by dunes surrounded so it wasn't desert and miles. dunes really a desert or dunes dunes dunes, dunes. dang no dude. desert just dunes and they built like a city wow. out there it was it, it was absolutely in, in crazy crazy it doesn't even sound real it sounds like a freaking it was like, unreal. other planet or something it was unreal because like, we were in a like town like the future or something yeah we were in a town and then we drove 40 minutes into the dunes and on a four-lane highway yeah a brand new highway by the way um and then we just ended up in this like miniature city with had like roads yeah and tents everywhere with electricity they had um they had mma fights going on every night they had concerts what? they had like EDM. like real mma like there yes like we went and watched a fight like we went and watched an mma fight one night yeah what the yeah. hell there was a hangar. this is another planet you got you weren't on first class you got on a spaceship and <laughs> we're in star wars land <laughs> yeah. and you literally traveled to another planet yeah. you were in tatooine full yeah, sorry I, to break I, the news I, to you yes I guess. Well, and then there's a, there's, a, there's, you know, uh, they, they figured there was 200,000 people there that, that weekend or that week that we were there. And, uh, yeah, there was a, there was a hangar there. Insane. There's a giant hangar with all kinds of movie cars, like Fast and the Furious cars. Okay. Bugattis. Yeah. Like there was these, it was these four Chinese billionaires, um, which, uh, that, that, that built or building the park that were building the park. An off road park. It. I wonder if that park. park's still around today. I don't know. I would like to, I would like to see if it, it was, is. It was. It sounds like it may have been taken by the desert. Maybe. I just imagine because like their a wild plans, desert. In their plans, it was they were going to build the world's largest building. It was going to be there. It was going to be like this giant stadium that they like held off-road events at. Wow. And races at. I think we need to look into that, guys. Do some research for us. But, yeah. Um, um, it was something, something desert park. I can't remember what it was. That's sick. Thank you guys for watching this. For the rest of the podcast, check us out on iTunes. Google Play, Spotify, like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, help us grow, let's get it. Oh.